Carousel was uh, was a great song that, that that Mike Sabello wrote, and I just cut a song with his and, and Donna Summer's album. Then you just just a little. No, anyway, um, uh, and uh, fortunately or unfortunately, you know, hearing uh, there was only room in, in the album for one mood like uh, Carousel or uh, Human Nature. And human Nature was a choice we had to make, you know. Um, and uh, but they they were hard to give up, you know. It was not like they were songs that were bad songs at all, you know. So we did a thing that Mike Sembello had written. This was around when he had done Maniac and stuff for Flashdance. I love Sembello. Uh, we took that out Carousel, nice, but it uh, Toto, who I just adored. I, David was uh, David Page was fourteen and twelve years old. His father. Marty used to bring him over to the house and we'd play jazz and stuff on it. He's a great musician, man. Pokara, all those guys are fantastic. Luca, too. So we worked together a lot. And um, they sent over two demos, two things they thought would be right for Michael. And we left the tape on and forgot to take it off. The tape they sent with the first two songs was okay, but we're not, we're not impressed, you know. And all of a sudden, this, at the end, there was all this silence. And I said, I said, why? Why? Da, 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 da. Why? Why? That was all. It was just a dummy lyric and just a very skeletal thing. And, and I tell you, I get, I get goosebumps just talking about it. And I said, what the hell is that? You know, that's what took Carousel out. I said, this is where we want to go because it's got such a, a, a wonderful flavor. So I called up David and he said, yes, yeah, Steve Picaro wrote that. That's a de little demo he had on, this, on the end of our tape, you know. And I called... Uh, Chuck K to get uh, John Bettis to write a lyric to it, you know, because and because uh, I liked his stuff. He did.